a hound on the mend. So we ran back there, and she was very scared and kind of like holding into herself. A shocking injury. Yeah, she's a sweet girl. I mean, look at her face. Now, owners wondering who could do such a thing. She's just big brown puppy dog eyes. This dog ran away for a couple of hours. But when it came back, the owners just could not believe what happened. The news station's Danielle Lama is live in Ormond Beach tonight with the details. Danielle. Luann and Charles, this all starts out with a pretty common story. Dog gets out of the yard. People go look for the dog. They end up finding her. But then things take a really unexpected turn. And we pulled her out. And she had a wound on her leg. We thought maybe she was hit by a car. And, you know, the thought of being shot at was never even a concept to us. But here are the x rays, and there's the bullet in the dog's leg. And immediately, you know, it's shock, utter, utter shock. Liz Malstead says Katie, a walker hound, escaped from her yard Monday afternoon after getting through a hole under her fence. She lives in this gated community in Ormond Beach. Liz called Katie's owner, Nelsie Caliendo, and the two quickly got a group together to start searching. They say after no sign of the dog for two hours, they circled back to the house, and there she was. So we ran back there, and she was very scared and kind of like just folding into herself. Katie was rushed to the vet. That's when the women say they got the news that she had been shot with a 22 caliber bullet. They still have no idea where the dog went in those two hours or who hurt her. And tonight, Katie is doing much better, though Caliendo says the bullet is still in her leg and she may need surgery. We, we don't want this to happen to anybody else. I uh, want to be able to feel safe when I let the dogs out. It does make you wonder what, this, what else this person is capable of.